It's hard for a new coach to come to a team with players that he didn't recruit and he doesn't know. But coach John Gross was able to identify right away who his hard workers were. The guys probably stood up the most is Dana Edwood. Uh, Dana made you know, 23,000 shots on his own this summer. You'll see him in early in the morning. You know, sometimes I'll even ask him if he wants the lights on in the oven. He's shooting in the dark. And, you know, he, he just he loves the game. He can't get enough of it. Hearing this amount of praise from the head coach gave Egwu the confidence he needed going into this season. The relationship between coach and the man in the middle is almost like a father and son. Gross told his starting center exactly what he wanted from him this season on the first day of practice. I like the improvement I made and uh, he liked the hard work I put in, so he definitely encouraged me to continue to get better and uh, get to work on my game. The young coach and the young center are working to learn from each other. As they spend more time together, Egwu's trust in Gross increases. Uh, he's definitely grown yeah, since he's been here. You know, he finally you see how enthusiastic to be here. He really wants this room to grow and get better. So he's trying to all that. With players graduating and moving on to the next level, opportunity for increased playing time became available for Egwu. Expand the floor time would normally scare an underclassman player, but Coach Gross gives his sophomore center the encouragement he needs to be successful. Oh, because you know, you're the guy, you're the one starting, so uh, you just have to come out there and do what you gotta do. You don't gotta worry about making something special. You go out there and do what you actually do, do your role, and it'll be all good. And Egwu is doing just that. His length and height strengthens Illinois' interior defense and rebounding. He's a large part of the reason why Illinois is second in the conference in defensive rebounding and third in block shots. If this production continues, Illinois has a chance to accomplish a lot more than what many predicted they would in what was considered to be a lost season. You know, obviously, the main goal is to make the SAT tournament and compete for the Big Ten title. But, um, as long as we, you know, because you played hard, we get together, play tough. I think those goals are, are definitely constant. Reporting from Champaign-Urbana, I'm Paul Timmer.